Hey, hey, what's going on everyone? RC84 here. Like always, thanks for watching. So my friends, in this episode of WOTS, working on the site, that's right. I kind of abbreviated the name to make it a little bit better. Uh, so it wouldn't be so a long title. But anyway, in this video, you're going to be watching my dad running the dump truck for the first time. Now, my dad is one of my biggest fans and my biggest supporter in my hobby. He's been a part of this hobby for a long time now. He's helped me with numerous of builds. He's also helped me build the RC park. He's also helped me done some filming and stuff. So I'm very appreciative of him and everything he does for me and with me in the RC hobby. Now, in 2021, actually March, uh, his 60th birthday, I wanted to get him more involved in the hobby, not just helping me with the builds and building the park and stuff. I wanted him to actually be a part of the hobby, uh, driving the vehicles. Instead of sitting back and watching me RC, and my buddies RC, he can be a part of it. So for his 60th birthday, I ended up getting him the Axial SCX-10 to Roller builders, uh, Raw Builders Kit. And I reversed the roles on him. Instead of me building it, it was going to be him building, and I was going to help him with that build. So it was a great father and son project, and then teaching him how to crawl and run the vehicle. Now, here's the story also on this. A few years ago, my dad had a master stroke that left him partially paralyzed on his right hand side. So he has no right, you know, no movement in his right side. Now he's at a good state where he pretty much does everything on his own. He can walk, he can walk, he can talk, he can drive to the store, he can spend money. He can do a lot of things just being one-handed. And it truly is amazing seeing the things that he accomplishes or the things he does with only being one-handed. Sometimes I try to do stuff one-handed just to see if I can do it. And I was like, how the heck does he manage to do this? It's truly an amazing story. There's more on that story, but anyway, so I decided to put my dad on the RC dump truck to help me out there on the on the uh, construction site. Now, I did not know if he was gonna be able to do this or not because the type of controller is on a stick controller. So, you know, this is, uh, this is forward, or no, this is up and down. This is forward, reverse, left and right and stuff, all right? So I did not know if he could operate this type of controller being the way it is. He's been running his SEX-10, which is on a pistol grip controller, very small controller enough for him to actually uh, steer and throttle at the same time. So I did not know if he was gonna be able to run the dump truck, but he proved me wrong. He did run this thing, and you're gonna see that in this video of him running the dump truck. And he did a great job. Little hiccups here and there, but that wasn't his doing. Uh, some of the stuff, sometimes the truck got a little stuck or got wedged up on something that caused him to get stuck. But uh, other than that, he did wonderful. And I'm very proud of seeing him doing that and, and trying to learn this vehicle. As he you know drives his more, he'll learn how to really operate this thing. But for the first time, he did a great job. It really helped me out on... Uh, you know, getting that dirt back there and stuff like that. So it really did help me out with having him there. And it's great to spend some father and son time just sitting back there in our scene. And he really loved it because he just sat right there and didn't have to walk or anything like that. He just operated the vehicle and you'll see that in this video. So I hope that you enjoy this video. And if you do, make sure you smash that thumbs like button, comment down below, and also subscribe to the channel if you have not, and hit that notification bell so you will know when I upload a new video. So my friends, thank you again for watching the video, and I hope that you enjoy it. I'll see y'all later.
like that. All right, turn the wheel. Yep. Okay, you can do it right there. Go back up. All right, hold it there and just bump the throttle a little bit. All right, there you go. Now you can lower your bucket or your bed. <laughs> All right, hold it right there. All right, then you just back up. Turn it right. All right. All right, back up. Keep backing up a little bit. Yeah. Keep going. All right. Now turn it right. Yep. Yep. Oh. You're fired. Yep, you turn your wheel. Yep.
<laughs> Just yeah. dump it. All right, bump it. Bump the throttle. Keep going. All right. Yeah, it's off. All right, right there, and then go back up. You're fired. I'll just check it straight back. Yeah, right there. And bump it up, bump the throttle a little bit. All right, and lower it back down. Right there. All right, turn it right. Alright, back up. 